Well, besides thanking the weather, there are so many people that I need to thank, but I am going to start with all of the Hilltop residents who are here because you have supported us for so many years. And I'm going to go back to 2010 when we had a levy in front of you at a time when money was so difficult after the Great Recession and you supported us in a big way, and no one is more deserving than this. And please recognize our Hilltop friends. You're gonna clap a lot, so get started, everybody. Good afternoon, I'm Katherine Strauss. I'm very proud to be here on behalf of the Columbus Metropolitan Library Board of Trustees. I'm pleased today to be joined by my fellow trustees, Tim Frohmeyer, Tom Katzenmeyer, David White, and Carla Williams-Scott. On behalf of the Board of Trustees, it is our pleasure to welcome you as we officially dedicate our new Hilltop Branch. It's evident from Pat's long list of acknowledgements. Building projects are major undertakings, and we would not be here without you and the work of many people and our one CML approach. This reflects the passion and commitment of all of our CML team members in every department. The Columbus Metropolitan Library is a great resource for so many families in the Columbus area. Each branch gives adults and kids access to the wide range of books, and it also serves as a space to gather, to meet new people, to search for employment, to learn, study, use technology, and much more. I first fell in love with the Imagination Library because uh, I was with my grandkids one day, and they got their Imagination Library books in the mail. And I just remember them getting them in the mail, ripping off the cellophane wrapper, and you know, it was a read to me, read to me moment. I thought it was such a great thing. I thought, you know, if Mike becomes governor, this is something I want for every child in Ohio. Um, for me personally, the library is the place where I went to to learn English. I taught myself how to learn English before I even started public schools. It's where I came to learn my ACTs to make it to college. It's even where I learned um, how to take an ASVAB to, when I had aspirations to join the Army. So <laughs> libraries I know firsthand are our gateway to knowledge and culture, and they play a very fundamental role to our society. John, come on up. I've got a special presentation from Speaker Robert Cup from the Ohio House. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, very simply put, this is the right investment at the right time in the right place. What you see here before you. Staff and members of the Ohio House and everyone that cares about what we're doing here on the Hilltop. And I want to tell you, this library is a lifeline. This is where people go to reconnect. This is where reading starts. I heard First Lady Fran talk about how reading begins at the library, and you're, you're so right. This is a place where special connections are forged between parents and their children. We know that libraries have taken on more responsibility to become a safe haven in the community, especially during this pandemic. They have helped our children with their homework and, and our adults with finding jobs and allowing our uh, neighbors that are unhoused to connect to services. This library and libraries throughout Columbus and Franklin County have truly become a cornerstone of support and care. Hilltop is a community that has struggled with increased violence. So this library and this opening is very important, especially for our young people to give them a safe place to go. Um, and you've heard from the speakers before me how important libraries are, the resources that libraries provide in our communities. And in many ways, I don't think there's anything new I can say to add to that. What I just wanna add is that libraries are so powerful that even in the midst of the pandemic, when we couldn't go inside, we felt their presence in our communities. But I also love our libraries because of their power as magnets in our community to open up kids' minds to the love of reading and to help adults stay in touch with their love of reading throughout their lives. But as someone who's grown up on the hilltop and spent the majority of my life on the hilltop, I could not be more thrilled to welcome you today to your new hilltop library. My staff and I are incredibly excited to come to work here every day, to live and work every day in this beautiful branch and to serve this community. We pledge to do everything we can to make this building as impactful as it can possibly be 
to helping this community. Five, four, three, two, one, yay! All right, I will ask that our second group of Young Minds ribbon cutters come forward. 